Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today we're gonna be doing a meal prep video for a family of three and a half and what I eat while I am breastfeeding and while I'm trying to lose weight while breastfeeding, but trying to keep it toddler friendly. All right, so the first thing that I'm going to start out with in this video is I'm going to show you how I create my grocery lists and how I plan my meals for throughout the week. The first thing that I try to decide is how do I feel like eating this week or how do I feel like eating this month? Because it does change from month to month. This time around I decided I was going to go a little less heavy on um, the carbohydrates, so less potatoes, less sweet potatoes, and less rice. And I personally will be doing more um, carbohydrates in the form of vegetables um, and having a protein along with that. Now, what I will be showing you for the most part today in this meal prep video is mostly how I do my vegetables, how I package things up. So, all right, when I am creating my meal list for the week, first thing I will do, like I said, is decide how I wanna eat. Um, paleo, Whole30, Keto, like what am I feeling that week or that month? and you know what's my husband feeling for that month. So my husband and I do not eat bread, but my daughter does, so we have a little bit of healthy bread in the house, and her bread is specifically just for breakfast. That's for in the mornings when we're going to preschool. I will typically give her like a banana and a piece of peanut butter toast. So um, everything else is mostly just vegetables and proteins. So in the spring and the summertime, I will do less like meals, so like less of like enchiladas, fajitas, chicken divan, casseroles, and what have you. And I will do more so like a simplified meal plan list um, so that it's versatile and we can mix it up. My sister-in-law uh, told me that she had been doing sheet pan veggies for her and her significant other and I loved the idea. So that is what we'll be doing for this week or for the next two weeks because I typically shop in about two week sections um, and then I will fill in throughout the weeks like if I need anything extra. So like, you know, your produce will sometimes go bad and you'll need more fruit, vegetables, what have you. Here on my list, um, I've got my sides, my proteins, and my carbs. These, So this is my meal list on this side, and then on this side is my grocery list. So what I'll do is I will look at what my meal list is. So I've made like sides, proteins, carbs. So I've got roasted garlic veggies, rainbow veggies. Um, I added Southwest veggies to it as well. And those will be our sides, our vegetable sides. And then I've got grilled chicken, salmon, steak, pork tenderloin for the proteins. Um, and then for carbohydrates, just because my husband and my daughter do still like to have carbs, um, I have basmati rice, so white basmati rice, along with these baby potatoes. They're so good, but I can't have any. <laughs> so I will go through that list and then decide, all right, what do I have in the house? And what do I not have in the house? And is there any sauces that I want with that? Is there, if I'm gonna be having salads, you know, will I want, you know, a dressing? And so I got the stuff to make my homemade ranch. Um, so anyway, so I go through there, and then I go through like all of the essentials. So I'll think, all right, do I have butter? Do I have avocado oil? Do I have unsweetened vanilla almond milk? Do I have my coffee? Those are staples in our house. So that's how I create my grocery list. I'll go through all of our um, like meals, so like our sides, proteins, and carbs, um, and then I will go through um, like what our staples are in the house. And I just mentally know what those staples are, um, so I'm able to easily write them down. So like eggs, bacon, those are staples in our household. So that's what I build off of to make my grocery list. Now, um, going back to the sides, proteins, and carbs, those can be used for both dinner and for lunch. So it's really easy for Mike and I with our busy schedule just to grab what we need and go for lunch. Or um, if we're going to be doing a dinner, we can just quick whip up a protein, you know, grill it or put it in the air fryer or put it in the oven or whatever we're gonna do with that protein, however we're going to prepare that protein. Um, and then we just have to quick heat up the vegetables on the side, super easy. What I'm gonna start out with is I'm gonna show you my sheet pan veggies and I'll go recipe by recipe. I will have my Pinterest recipes linked down below for you guys. And then um, I will also have my Pinterest linked below. So that if you wanna follow me and follow my boards and all of my recipes, you're more than welcome to. All right, so let's hop on into the vegetable prep.
guys well that is going to wrap it up for today's video this was just very like impromptu prepare my vegetables with me I've just gotten so many questions lately as to like how I've lost the baby weight and how I eat when I'm breastfeeding etc so I wanted to share just a little bit of my meal prep with you guys if you guys enjoyed this kind of video on my channel please be sure to give it a big thumbs up leave a comment down below with your favorite health foods and make sure that you're subscribed to my channel so that you don't miss out on any of my other future videos and my baby weight loss and my breast pumping and my babies and my husband <laughs> okay subscribe to us your beard is like actually really soft do you condition that absolutely mm. All right, and I will see you guys on Thursday for a clothing boutique haul. I gotta get this cleaned up. I gotta get the kids in the bathtub because somebody had a blow up. Okay, bye you guys.